the best in the world are home. For the first time since helping win the World Cup, the Portland Thorns four national team members are competing at Providence Park. Tobin Heath, Lindsey Horan, Adriana French and Emily Sonnet got a pregame hero's welcome. Um, I thought it was really cool because so a lot of my favorite players are those four. Whether in Thorns Red or the Red, White and Blue, fans have always adored them, but it's clear. That was so, so cool. There was something extra special about seeing them on this night. It was so cool to be like really up close to them. The Thorns team reunion will be short lived. Soon, its four World Cup team members will break away once again for the U.S. Women's National Team Victory Tour. They'll play five games across the U.S. against international opponents. It could be argued that the women's soccer fan base in Portland is the strongest in the U.S. But at this point, Team USA's Victory Tour won't be stopping in the Rose City. One team's loss is the nation's gain. And through the lens of its youngest fans, I think it was pretty cool that they got to like share all the players. A true act of benevolence. In Southwest Portland, <laughs> Catherine Cook, KGW News. What a show, 5-0. Oh, yes. uh, a little disappointing that the tour won't be coming through Portland, but they get to bless some other cities and hopefully build the fan right. base there because we certainly don't have a problem with the fan base here. Uh, officials actually saying that tonight was the largest crowd ever for a Portland Thorns game. Okay, listen to this number. 22,329 people packed Providence Park to cheer on the Thorns.